Hey, it's the Scotch Test Dummies. I'm Scott. Bart here. Back to the land of Canada. Woo! Going Canada, Go baby. Canada. Blame Canada. <laughs> Single malt, Crown <laughs> Royal. Woo! We're going to test it! Canadian whiskey style. I was thinking Trey Parker. Blame Canada, baby. I was going to say, what's with the Blame Canada? Oh, it's just part of the song. <laughs> I think they got a Grammy for that. Blame Canada? Yeah. You haven't seen that? No. Bigger, Longer, and Uncut, South Park? No. That was their main song, is Blame Canada. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, they won an award for that. All right. I'm going to harken back. I went to elementary school, middle school, and high school with Trey. Name drop. All right, yeah. next. He doesn't even know who I am. I was going to say, great story. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's it. I went to school with him. I went to school I with remember him. him. He doesn't know me. Crown Royal, single malt. 45% ABV. Nice to see. Okay, that is 700, 750. Okay, awesome. That's good too. I was waiting for the Wait. other shoe to drop. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. There, here. Well, drop it. Shoe drop. Look at this. Comes with a bag. Harken back to Crown Royal Harvard Northern Harvest Rye. Ooh, remember? It's a harken? Oh, remember, I still got some. We were still building your bar, or you yep. were building your bar. We were shooting by your bookcases. Yes. We reviewed Crown Royal Northern Harvest Rye. You've named it several different winter rye, and I don't, you could yeah, never I remember. Couldn't get it. Northern, Northern Harvest, Harvest NHR. Rye. I think I got it now. I don't know if I would have given it the initials. We. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we we were early. To, we had just picked that one up. It was new in the store. We were right. few. Well, we grabbed and, several. And well, we grabbed like I think four that different one. Canadians. You were back. Oh well, yeah, yeah. So and then I tried I the cheapest one NHRs. first. Yeah. And I was like, oh my. Um, but then it went on to win Whiskey of the Year, that which was a little suspect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it got a lot of attention, a lot of attraction, and all of a sudden, we our channel got a little boost. That was that the one. first boost. Yeah. That's true, because we were the only ones that had reviewed it. Yeah. <laughs> um, there's mixed mixed thoughts on Crown Royal. Um, a lot of people drink it. Not a lot of people out there looking for reviews of it. Well, this one says it's delicately crafted in Canadian cold. Yeah. Canadian and Canadian whiskey, generally, the majority of Canadian whiskey, Crown Royals, you know, that people buy are for mixing. People drink them. Right. Yeah, there are better examples out there. Can Canadian then Canadian whiskey also generally they do this blending where bourbon is the mash bill is made up and then it's distilled. Right. They'll Can distill one hundred percent corn, one hundred percent rye, one hundred percent barley, one hundred percent corn. You know, wheat. I already said corn. Wheat yeah. was what I was looking for, and then they'll mix. And that. then they, they're like, "Give me sixty percent." I gotta that, admit, 20 I think that's that. how I would do it. It gives you a little it, bit more flexibility. In the post. Yes. Yeah, because you could taste that and go, right. wow, that's good. I only want 15% of that in there. Yeah, or be like, that needs a little bit more boost, add yes. a little bit more. Yeah, you could taste it and then go, mm, yeah, you're right. Rye it up, yeah. baby. Yeah. Rye it up. Yeah. Yeah. Whereas if you've got it all thrown in together, then you're like, now taste it. I don't know. I do like you got rid of the bag. That was kind of a fancy bag, different. What's the purple? Purple's the normal purple crown oil bag. Soft. We That's, had one that was like a suede one time. Yeah, they're all different. I don't remember There's which the, was like the, a tan the, leather suede. The NHR had what felt like hemp. <laughs> it was a rough bag. Oh. There's a cream colored bag. You know what I use these for on my nerdy side? Dice. Oh, mm. yeah. Board games. Uh, a lot of dopers like to use those to keep dopers their paraphernalia. Dopers love the paraphernalia. Canadian. Yeah, they like the purple. If you see the purple. Well, just the Crown Royal bags. Yeah, but they're mostly the purple. <laughs> they're not buying that. Well, yeah. Yeah. Anywho. anywho People are like, hello, we, get we, to the review. We digress. <laughs> what happened? What happened? How, how do they know Why about Why do they talk about dopers? That's what I was going to say. <laughs> what, what are they talking about? Push rods? What? <laughs> What's a push rod? Smells like a, a malty scotch. 
little bit of some some caramel, some yeah. malt. I love single malt. So we're talking. Is this 100 percent barley? Is that there's what we're no about? information on the bottle. Okay. It should be. It should be. Sometimes single Canada malt. has been known to Blame wiggle me. around the the rules. Definite the rules. Yeah, with the bourbon mash. Okay. Remember that one? Mm. They got in a little trouble mm. for that one. Mm -hmm. But no, um, nice nose. A little bit more than I expected on the nose, I think. Oh, I'm, I'm ex oh. I was expecting a little bit lighter, usual Crown Royal nose. I'm going to let you sip this, and then I'll let you comment. That is very different. Mm. Oh, I know, but I'm mm. going to have to go back in. It kind of flashed early as like a... I felt like I was getting more of a rye content mm. early. Malty, oaky. What are you looking for? Very. Oh. You did the shoe. Very, drops. very single malt scotch esque, mm. I would say. Light oaks, some caramel. I was just going to look at the box here and see if there's any more definition. I get like a pine nut. Yeah, a little bit of a pine, a little bit of a mint. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like an effervescence. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, and then the mint pack, like a mint leaf. Hmm. So they have some some tasting notes and some stuff about Crown Royal. And they got a little sheen on the box. Looks but like there's a other than it says our exceptional single malt is expertly crafted in the crisp Canadian <laughs> coldness. No other info. I mean, so we're gonna assume this is a hundred percent single malt. Okay, just, although there's nothing on the box the, about that. The crisp Canadian what? Coldness? The cold, crisp Canadian cream. Cold. <laughs> Cold. Yeah. Um, it's different. It's. I'm not saying this isn't 100% single malt, but it's kind of weird that they wouldn't distinctly say that. Yeah, we don't know their rules. What can they call single malt? Right. Like, if it's an American single malt, there's some general rules. If it's a single malt scotch whiskey, there's distinct rules from the UK. But that's why I say I like I like a rule set. You can't play chess if he wants to move the knight like it's a queen or a bishop. We couldn't sit down at the same table. You gotta have a rule set. I don't know what this is. Yeah. What is it? How does it rule? <laughs> is it bad? No. Mm -mm. Uh, it's weird. I'm getting a little bourbon caramel on the mm -hmm. finish. Mm -hmm. I get a little bit of Brock's hard caramel candy is kind of what's coming through, which is what I usually don't get on a single malt. Hmm. I like the 45%. It's boosted it up a little bit. And I do like it. I, I mentioned caramel, but yeah, it's almost bourbon-esque caramel. Yeah. Hmm. And then I, Interesting. Get, I get on the finish... Like a spice. That's where maybe cinnamon. I thought it was like a rye. I don't know. There's a cinnamon. No drip for me. I'm down at the very low. Yeah, I know. I didn't pour as much. <clears throat> I think. Art's draining them. Gotta be careful. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Hold on. <laughs> blip, blip, blip. <laughs> Watch out. Uh, this, this, this is a better palate and a better mouthfeel than I was expecting. Um, I was just with, with Crown Royals. Um, reputation. I expected a little bit lighter, yeah, softer, sweeter, like style. Yeah, it's punching a little it's, heavier yeah. than what I expected. Yeah, good, good verbology there. Thank you. Or adjective, would that be an adjective or alliteration? Both. It's an it's adjective and a verb. Sure. Punching, punchy, <laughs> punching above its weight. Score. This isn't doing much for me. It's not bad. It's not quite what I expected, but it's more than what I expected from Crown Royal 86. That's right, yeah. I'll really? Go with you on 86. Number. Yeah. I was close. I was thinking 87, but there's just mm -hmm. something odd. I was thinking 85, 86. I mean, there's but nothing it is. off putting here. It's no. just, it's fine. Price. That'll be the tail here. 50. Mm -hmm. 50 bucks. Mm. Mm. Um, Tastes a little odd. 750 though. 750. Yeah. yeah. And um, 
The Canadian cold. <laughs> ice, baby. Looks like ice. That is true. And if that My wife important. loves her the Canadian cold. She loves all the crown looking caps and everything. She always gets mad when I recycle them because they, they look special. <laughs> so they got something going with the marketing. I don't, I mean, I think it's worth picking up if you see it, if you want to try it. Hmm. And I'll be interesting to see the comments and then find out later if this is 100% single malt or are they skirting the <laughs> the labeling requirements there a little bit I again. I think they should have added on their single malt bourbon mash <laughs> just to throw it in. Rye. There. Just, yeah. Northern. Yeah, northern cold single malt rye. cold rye bourbon mash rum. <laughs> Finish. Finish. With <laughs> small letters on the bottom. People be like, what the hell? What the hell is this? <laughs> yep. All right. If you love the show, you like the chit chat, you like the banter, you can go to Patreon, look up Scotch Test Dummies. You can support for a dollar. We'll talk about your name on the show if you do that. If you do $2 a month, just $2 a month, we'll shout it with what we call. Gusto. That's right. Gusto. Mm -hmm. What else we got? Ratatouille Gusto. Yes. We have glasses. Go to scotchtestdummies.com. You can pick up glasses, coins, barrel caps, hats, shirts, all kinds of stuff. Help support the show. Keeps the lights on. Keeps the whiskey coming. Scotch it, you. Scotch. Gods. Solange. A. Dummies. Canadian. Blame style. Canada. <laughs>